Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP, and today we're playing Crusader Kings 2, Jade Biz, episode 168. So I've been looking around, and uh, I'm the Duke of Thessalonica, and I really don't own all of Thessalonica. I could theoretically, uh, you know, do a plot to broke stuff. You know, I could kill a lot of people if I really wanted. And I could probably plot to revoke land. I'm not sure why I would want to revoke the county of Jerusalem, for example. But I guess that's, you know, st something I could do. Uh, there's not, not much that I really want to do. It's really weird. I would, would have thought I could do that. Well, c'est la vie, I suppose. Um... You want to kill your wife? Why? Uh, I spent a lot of time and money investing in my vassals' lands just to improve them. And that let me pick the war chest ambition, so now in a short while I will have the war chest ambition out of the way. I'm going to let that happen. <laughs> like that, huh? National tax modifier, time, you know, plus 10%. So, I've been thinking. And my main thought right now is, you know, who do I have a truce with? Who do I not have a truce with? I have one army there. Two armies there. I only really need one army there. You know what? You're closer. You go there. And I want the Jalilid Sultanate out of my life. What wars can I take? Ascalon Holdings. That would be against the Council. The Council is stupid, and it is returning favors to Dionysus the Drunkard. Dionysus the Drunkard is simply an advisor. You know what? I should not be a schmuck. I should du double check that. Dionysus the Drunkard. Dionysus the Drunkard. Dionysus the Drunkard. Uh, guess who's no longer on my Council? Dionysus the Drunkard. Goodbye! Now then, let's try this again. Council will be for it. Ascalon Holdings, declare the war. And hopefully... That's all the land he owns, I think. Daughter was born to Gregorius of Cisnad and Aaliyah Yesoros, named Zini. She must struggle hard. He raises a substantial army. Not as substantial as this, but substantial. This is probably a mercenary crew or something. Oh, this chick. Who are you? Freely. Well, I've got another Dutch in my dynasty. I'm old. I'm honest. Paranoid, cruel, fool. How romantic? Yeah, why not? I mean, whatever, right? What does it hurt? 99%. Why am I at 99%? He will not peace out. He probably should. Oh, sweet. You're my dynasty. You hate me, though. Why do you hate me? You kind of see why. I guess killing his army doesn't count as a major battle. He has a vassal somewhere. Over here. I 
I guess I have to beat his vassal up before he will uh surrender to me. Serbian revolt, huh? You're desperate of Serbia. It's fully developed. I'm actually impressed. Well, I'm going to have him full occupied before too long. So I don't mind uh, ransoming off people. Do I have a siege leader? Doesn't seem like I do. that easy traded two kingdoms you freaking idiot What can I arrange a marriage with my daughter for? A lot of chiefs will do it. Just better do the whole hair thing. Uh, Duchy of Seville is my kinsman, kinsman, kinsman. Tennis of Athol. Not much going on right now, I'll tell you that much. I don't have a truce with the Seljuks, do I? In fact, it seems I don't have a lot of truces. Mercia. Who 
cares? Nobody cares. No, but it's saying I'm a truce breaker, but it says that I don't have a truce here. That's really weird. Pretty sure Leon's gonna wipe the floor with him, which is fine. Tever. Tever is a two province miner. Get him. If he wants to tag me across a river. I don't see why I wouldn't at least consider letting him take the penalty, reinforcing into it. Now he wants to run away like a coward. Uh oh. This could be a problem. So I don't have the money available, but how'd you even get it? Well, whatever. He wants to peace out. I swear that's not the province I went for, but whatever. This man has 8 out of 10 holdings. That's these two. Counties, kingdoms de jure, Russia. Ulich. Ulich, get it, get it, get it, go. You better not give that land away. You are not over your domain limit. You're not even close to your domain limit. That would be a problem. Someone's planning to kill me. Oh no. This is in the big list. I don't know what is. Um. I know I'm going through the list again. I know you get bored when I do this. I'm sorry. I just kind of have to. This is why. Fabricate a claim on the Roman Empire. I can imprison him, strip him, and take him down. He's not that strong. He's relatively weak. Yeah, I know. Have fun with that guy. 
My daughter-in-law, the Queen of Rush. Well, since I'm such a nice guy... It is a valuable pop-up. It's a lot of money. You still won't give it up. Wait, is he not my dynasty, this guy? He is my dynasty. He's trying to screw over someone else with my dynasty, but... Huh. Grand Master Holy Sepulchre is my heir. Is my dynasty. That's interesting. Would not have seen that coming. Just gotta make sure no one's really plotting against me anymore. when it does that stop plotting against your own dynasty Okay, that's done. Scorchkin Sardinia is revolting. What's he personally hold? Holds Mallorca. Let's go take Mallorca. Let's get that. Let's get that. Oh, Nori wants something. Isn't that cute? Alright, well, uh, that's us starting a bunch of nonsense with our vassals. You know, controlling our realm a little bit. Next episode, we're going to take care of that. We're going to keep stripping down our enemies in the north, making our life a little bit prettier, I gotta admit. And we'll deal with things as they, it comes. Uh, I want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. It really does help the channel grow. It lets me know what you're watching so I can make more of it, and I really do appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And as always on this channel, La Paz.